What shocks me about Christopher is I'm about to do it for the first time. He's done it 21 times. Welcome to the touchdown. Brother, man, it's you, good to be here. Oh, yes. What? Oh, yes. 21 times. 21 times, man. Unbelievable. Before I became an ambassador, I was already donating. My, my father was actually a catalyst to that. I follow in his footsteps, his example. He's always been, you know, on the forefront of changing things. Has something must have driven you to be so passionate in the way you Is there something close to you, somebody close to you, you need a lot time? What is fine you to do? Well, um, that eventually happened while I had already been donating blood, but I'm, I'm of the uh, mindset that you need to use any platform that you have to be able to make a difference, to, to be able to inspire, to change your life. And being an ambassador for the blood bank, I mean, you make a tangible difference, you know what I mean? That's use right. that platform to um, basically let people know what this is about and that they need to donate and save a life. I mean, you donate one time, you save three lives, man. That's Hello. crazy. Hello. It, now, and it costs you nothing. It costs you nothing. Thank you. Tell me about But now, what is your role with the blood drive? Well, um, I'm here because I basically donated my 21st time. Uh, I, like I said early on, I'm a blood ambassador as well. True. And uh, yeah, it's just to make people understand and know that, you know what? Less than one percent of South Africans uh, donate blood. I just followed you. There is a I just followed uh, you on Instagram. Sure, sure, sure. You got a lot of friends, family. Do you encourage them to do the same thing too? I do, I do, I do. We need so many people to donate blood, man. Um, there's just there's a huge shortage. I mean, if you think 52 million people, right? Sure. And less than one percent donate blood. We need those numbers to come up, man. And we now, up. being winter, a lot of people are having cold and flus, and it's, I think the rate of donation is quite low. So this is where we need. Post. Absolutely, absolutely. I mean, uh, the guys are doing a fantastic job here at, at Sandus, the South African National Blood Service, by getting the word out there and letting people know, you know what, you need to donate. It okay. doesn't matter if you're scared of needles, whatever the case may be, come on, man, you just need to donate. Let's talk about your campaign. Let's talk about, shout out to you, Top Bidding, doing a good Thank job. Thank you, man, I appreciate yes, it. Thank yes, you, bro. I'll be checking that out, too. Catch Christopher uh, on Top Bidding, SABC3, ladies and gentlemen. I think you're doing an amazing job. Thank you, brother. you got to have some exciting campaigns coming up next. Is there anything you might want to share with us? Um, uh, there are a couple of things in the pipeline. At the moment, like I said, you know what? Uh, basically, the reason for why I work as hard as I want to work or uh, why I want to achieve what I want to achieve is so that I'm able to use this platform and the name that I have to be able to make a difference, to be able to inspire others. And so. Uh, South African National Blood Service is one of the uh, partners that I'm a good ambassador for. Uh, Jam is one of them. The late Simba Mary was grown up by Jam, joint aid management. Those guys feed uh, so many kids just with 50 rand a month. So you just donate 30 bucks, you'll feed a kid for a month. And then I'm involved with the Field Band Foundation as well. That's what's important to me. But you're a giver, man. You're a giver. 